subscribe to language animated channel and then click the bell icon to get notification about every new lesson every day Assalamu alaikum dosto welcome back friends I'm gonna give you some useful vocabularies about bathroom maybe you will need this when you go to the bathroom and at the same time as I'm explaining how to read and write you'll also see the reading and writing of these words in this video just keep practicing with these lessons one day you will see the results I will just give you six words in this video because we will improve slowly and one day we will start talking in Urdu so without wasting time let's start the lesson first word is غسل 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 means bath or taking shower second word is دوائیو کا خانا دوائیو کا خانا دوائیو کا خانا it means medicine cabinet دوائیو means medicines now here دوائیو is plural کا means of or the and khana means house but there it is used as cabinet okay third word is shisha 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 it means mirror fourth word is sabun sa bun sabun it means soap don't overuse the soaps they are very harmful to our skin fifth word is tolia 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 it means towel most of us call mom to give the towel when we are taking shower right number 6 wash basin wash basin wash basin it's the same as in english wash basin wash your hands before eating it's a healthy way so let's watch the recorded video to learn how to read these words the first word was غسل so it's written like this This is غسل. Now which letters we have? We have غين, سين, and لام. So we will combine these and then we, it becomes like this. First, position of غين is like this. Then middle position. Middle position. And then لام. The last position is like this. So this becomes غسل. غسل means bath. The next word was دوائیو کا خانہ. It's written like this. Now to write this we have Dal Dal Wow Alif Here Hamza Churiye Wow Nun Runa Okay and then the, here we have Kaf and Alif. And here we have Khe, Alif, Nun, and He. Okay? So, when we combine, you, you can just watch 
you can just look at the sentence and then you can start writing okay you you, you don't need to make uh, the sentences by yourself just look at them and then write so dal here they are not connected so we will write as it's written dal wow alif now here connected this is hamza i told you when you write hamza you will just make something like this extra okay so here middle position of chotiye now here now here you will connect uh, wow with chotiye okay chotiye so it will connect like this dawayo then noon gunna dawayo now here kaf alif ka kaf first position of kaf and then you will connect alif dawayo ka here khana first position kha kha and then alif kha noon noon ha first position of noon and then last position of ha is like this khana dawayo ka khana it means medicine cabinet the next word is shisha she now we have here shin choti ye again shin and then he very simple you don't need to worry first position of shin then this is um ye and the middle position of ye is here then again shin and he it will be like this shisha okay shisha mirror next was tolia to le ya tolia means towel now te wow lam choti ye and he so when we combine the first position of te then we will connect with wow like this then lam first position of lam this is ye choti ye middle position of ye is like this and then he last position is like this tolia tolia means towel next was sabun soap sa sabun here we have sat alif b and noon now when you see the urdu alphabets by itself it will be complete letters okay when you make sentence or word it changes it changes their shape their um, their positions and their shapes okay like this now you will not write this just first position of sat then you will connect with alif okay then be nun here it's complete by you will write in words first position of be and then noon so it becomes sabun sabun means soap when you wash your hands you will wash with sabun the last word is wash basin wash So here, be, ye, si, nun. Now we have wow, alif, shin. Here we have be, ye, chotiye, sin, and nun, besan. 
wash basin same as in English so you know this this is not connected and it's written as it's you can see here and to write this you will first position of be then middle position of ye then middle position of seen so here it will connect the last like this basin wash basin so that's all thanks for watching I hope everything is clear and if you have any question then please tell me in the comments and I will answer you guys if you enjoyed the lesson then please like this video and subscribe to language animated channel for more Urdu lessons like this thanks for watching Khuda Hafiz